Now, just picking up on that final point, Barnaby Joyce and Australian Biosecurity are on a collision course with one of Hollywood's biggest stars. Pirates of the Caribbean star Johnny Depp has, without permission, flown his two little Yorkshire Terriers into Queensland while he makes his latest film in the franchise. And now Barnaby Joyce is in hot pursuit of Captain Jack Sparrow. Apparently the sexiest man alive, and that's not me. Uh -huh. A gentleman by the name of John Christopher Depp, 51 years old. Otherwise, AKA Jack Sparrow. Here they come. He has decided to bring to our nation two dogs without actually getting the proper certification and the, the proper permits required. Oh, Johnny Depp? Basically looks like he snuck them in. That's interesting. Mr Depp has to either take his dogs back to California or we're going to have to euthanise them. Oh, no, no, don't shoot! He's now got about 50 hours left to remove the dogs. Not sure I deserve that. We start letting movie stars, even though they've been the sexiest man alive twice, to come into our nation, then why don't we just break the laws for everybody? Not sure I deserve that. It's time that pistol and boo bug it off back to the United States. I may have deserved that. After that, I don't expect to be invited to the opening of uh, Pirates of the Caribbean. Alas, my children, this is the day you shall always remember as the day that you almost... Captain Jack Sparrow. Almost, perhaps, uh, captured... Uh, the fate of Pistol and Boo, it seems, because it has become something of an international incident. The US Embassy in Canberra has weighed in. It's issued a statement to advise Americans travelling to Australia that, quote, Australian customs authorities enforce very strict regulations uh, concerning the importation from all countries of items such as agricultural and wood products, as well as strict quarantine standards for other animal products, including pets. Now, Agriculture Minister Joyce, uh, he has the clock counting on Johnny Depp now and also, of course, on Pistol and Boo. Apparently, he can bring his private jet back to get them, but that has to happen in the next 40 hours or so, or else the Yorkshire Terriers uh, will be put down in the name of Australian biosecurity. So, no doubt you'll hear a lot more on this over the next 40 hours or so, if not, if not beforehand. But